Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Thank you all for joining me today. So in today's video, I'm going to be testing out the new NARS Light Reflection Foundation. This has been all over social media and YouTube and I wanted to give it a try myself. I'm always looking for uh, a foundation that offers a little glow or radiance and makes my skin look healthy and dewy. I've actually been using that Naturium skincare that I got in last month's um, AIA Beauty Bundle. And I have to say, I really, um, I'm really enjoying it. The serums are great. They are loaded with great things. Uh, this one here has niacinamide and 2% zinc which is awesome, plus hyaluronic acid and vitamin E. And then this serum is the vitamin C complex, which is hyaluronic acid, vitamin E, and vitamin C. And then I've been using their multi-peptide moisturizer. And this one has multiple peptides, plus ethylated vitamin C and panthenol. And then what I've, believe it or not, what I've really been enjoying is their Phyto Glow Lip Balm. This is incredible. First of all, it has this metal tip on it. And when I first opened it, I thought it was an eye cream. It's very cool and soothing on the lips. And it's what I'm wearing right now. And I wear it every day. I put it on. And you know, this nice um, shimmery glossiness that you see on my lips stays that way. Most lip glosses kind of dissipate and, and sort of dry down on your lips. This does not do that. Um, this, it, it, it moisturizes my lips and keeps them hydrated all day long. And I might, and I only put it on once, like late morning. I put it on in the morning after I do my skincare and this glossiness stays all day. Later on in the day, I go like this, press my lips and I can feel it working again. So this is a real plus in the skincare. Now granted, I'm, I'm not going to see a great deal of um, of change in my skin until I've used these products for about 28 days. So in, in that length of time, another couple of weeks, I'll continue using these and I'll do a dedicated video on the skincare and I'll do a more in-depth review because I think this is very nice quality. This is, you can get it on uh, at Target or at the, on the Naturium website. So, um, so far I'm loving the skincare, um, but the standout item for me is their lip balm. So if anything, uh, and I see no difference after 28 days, I'll use up the, the skincare products, but I'll continue to repurchase that lip balm. It's just that good. So let's get right into testing the NARS Light Reflecting Foundation. Okay, um, I got the lightest shade that was available at Ulta, which was Light Mont Blanc, Light 2. And I'm worried that this may be a little too dark for me when I, I got it, but we're going to give it a try. Again, there's what the box looks like. And then this is what the component looks like. It's that nice, it's a nice glass bottle and it's just your typical sort of plasticky top and it has a nice little pump. So because I'm testing this out, um, I don't generally use a primer just to give it a fair, a, fr a fair trial. All my skincare is done. And so I'm just gonna put this right on over the skin. And I'm going to use my BK Beauty um, 101 brush, which is one of my favorite foundation brushes. It's dense and, and well packed, and it has that slight tint. Forgive the dog barking in the background. We had just had a delivery. So the claims on this. Say it improves skin radiance by 61%, more even skin tone by 93%. See your skin in its best light. Light reflecting foundation instantly diffuses light to blur imperfections and smooth the look of skin. Powered by skincare ingredients, this product 
strengthens skin's barrier to maintain moisture day by day. This formula visibly improves skin's clarity even after makeup is removed. Medium, buildable coverage, natural finish, breathable all day wear. All right, so put, I put two pumps on my brush and I'm just gonna sort of dot it. Now you notice my eyes are done. Okay. So basically what I'm going to do is, is just blend this in. And right away, the color is actually quite good for me. It's not too dark at all. I am gonna put just a little more on. I'm just gonna pump another pump. And what I'm gonna do is just go over and dot on the areas where I want a little more coverage. And it's usually right here because um, I have some dark spots here. And rather than blend, I'm going to use a patting motion. And then blending, I always like to blend it down the neck. And then over the earlobes. Okay. So in looking at the foundation, I'm gonna look up a little hair there. I'm gonna look up close and see what I see. Okay, it's definitely a medium coverage right off the bat. It did give a little more coverage here and here. I think that's really nice. It doesn't seem to be settling into my fine lines. Yeah, so far so good. I'm enjoying this so far. Okay, um, I'm going to go and finish my makeup, and I will be right back for some final thoughts. Okay, I am back. I've got all my makeup on, and now I'm just going to give it another look. I did not use a setting spray because I want to see... I want to see the longevity of this, and um, I'll put that in, in the description box below. But... First impressions, I would have to say this is really nice. I love that it is not settling into my fine lines and wrinkles. Um, you know, it doesn't emphasize any dryness. Um, I don't see a lot of, um, you know, radiance. So um, maybe if I use it in the future with a, a um, radiant primer, perhaps then I might see a little more radiance. Of course, I don't, I don't have any um, highlighter on. I just put a little blush on after I set, set it. So. so anyway, that is my first impression and testing of the new NARS uh, Light Reflecting Foundation. I'm going to do a wear test today. I'm not going to film 
the wear test, but I will um, do a wear test and then in the remarks below, you can look and see how the wear was on this product. But right off the bat, I, I if it continues wearing the way it is right now, I'm gonna love this. This is gonna be one of, one of my holy grails. I love NARS foundations anyway. I love the natural radiance. That one is just so nice. In fact, do I have it in my everyday makeup drawer? Yes, I do. Yeah, this one is one of my favorites, Natural Radiant Longwear. This one's a really good one too. I love NARS foundation. So anyway, those are my thoughts. Um, we're gonna see how long it lasts. If you liked this video or found it helpful, please give me a thumbs up because that really helps out my channel and I do appreciate it. Also, please subscribe if you haven't already and hit that notification bell so you're advised of all my future uploads. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think of this foundation and how you think it looked on my skin. I'm loving it so far, but it, this is just my first time using it. I will link this in the description box below. And I thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.